A final push for a decision by voters on solving what's described as the city's most pressing financial burden. Today, Mayor Curry joined forces with two former mayors to promote County Referendum 1. The plan calls for extending the current half-cent Better Jacksonville sales tax beyond its expiration in 2030 to pay down the city's multi-billion dollar pension deficit. The plan also would close up to three of the city's underfunded pension accounts and require city employees to contribute 10 percent of their pay toward their retirement. The vote is on primary day, August 30th. Channel 4's Vic Michelucci tonight breaks down the details. Jacksonville's leaders, past and present, made their pitches today to some of the city's most active voters, the senior citizens. Hey, hey babe, how you doing? Charming the constituents and showing their support for Lenny Curry to woo older voters. We're going to win. Today, Jacksonville's mayor called upon two popular former mayors to promote his pension reform plan. So I'm asking you to vote yes on August 30th. That is four decades of experience spanning back to the 1970s, standing at the Mary Singleton Senior Center. Tommy Hazuri and Jake Godbold are Democrats, but they say they support Republican Lenny Curry's plan for a half cent sales tax after the Better Jacksonville plans, half-penny sales tax runs out in 2030. The only thing that's wrong with him is that he's a Republican, but that's okay. He <laughs> needs our help. He needs your help. Curry says he inherited a huge pension problem, nearly $3 billion in unfunded liability. That means the people watching this, when they pay their tax dollars in, one-third of their tax dollars are paying for pensions, not paving their roads, not taking care of their parks, not investing in public safety. Shame on us for letting it get like that. No matter who's to blame, we need to do something about it. There have been many naysayers, including a group that filed a lawsuit claiming the referendum's language is wrong and confusing, but the people we spoke to at the senior center seemed convinced that they will vote yes. Did they get your vote? Yes, they got my vote. Because Why is that? Well, it was some things that was, they, they said today that changed my mind. I'm going to vote, but I don't believe until I see it. Whatever you decide, yes or no, the vote on referendum one is August the 30th, but early voting has already started. We've got more details on our website, news4jacks.com. On the east side, Vic Michelucci, Channel 4, The Local Station.